Hey, to this question, you said there's no rapture, just Christ returning for his church, then judgment. Those judged to hell, go to hell, the rest of us choose paradise. I'm gonna break down your question because this is a, I need people to understand the difference between rapture and the second coming. So you said there's no rapture, just Christ returning for his church. You just proved the point of the rapture. The rapture is when Jesus Christ comes back for his church, which is the bride, right? The bride is the church. Jesus Christ, when he comes back for his church, it starts the tribulation, okay? So I need you guys to understand that. The rapture is before the tribulation. During the tribulation, there'll be a seven period where the Antichrist will rule and God is gonna release those seven vials, which is those seven seals, right? The church is not gonna be a part of that. That's tribulation. Second coming of Christ, when you say Jesus Christ comes back, right? Is when he, in that scripture in Matthew, where he says, all eyes shall see me from the east to the west. Jesus Christ will be coming back with his saints, which will be us, the church, but we'll be coming back with Christ. We'll have resurrected bodies. You understand? And we will rule with Christ in the millennial kingdom because once we bound up the devil, which is Jesus Christ, he bounds up the devil for a thousand years. He threw the antichrist and the false prophet into the lake of fire. They're the first two people to go into the lake of fire, right? The devil gets bound up for a thousand years. That starts the millennial kingdom. Then you talk about then judgment. Well, the judgment, well, there's two judgments. The first judgment is the judgment seat of Christ. That's for believers in Christ. Those who when raptured up, they will receive the things done in their body, right? Meaning they'll receive the gifts, right? The things that they've done for Christ, for the kingdom of God, right? Because they're already saved. The great white throne judgment is after the millennial kingdom, right? Because the devil will try to attack God after he comes out of prison for a thousand years. He will start Armageddon. Then the judgment, which is the great white throne judgment, right? And people get cast into the lake of fire. And after that, a new heaven and a new earth. Meaning after that, the old heaven and the old earth is going to pass away and it'll be a new. So I just need you guys to understand that. And for the person who gave me this question, for you to understand that there is a rapture. That's the whole point of being a believer in the first place.